and gentlemen, this is a light heavyweight contest over eight five-minute rounds, the best of three fall submissions, or one kill to decide the winner. Introducing from Belgium, on my left, Frank Dot. His opponent, ladies and gentlemen, from Salford, Paul Mitchell. And your referee, Anglo-French, Mr. Emile Poyle. And so, to the next second bout, arranged by Wrighton Promotions for Joint Promotions, featuring the participants from member countries of the European community. Paul Mitchell from Salford, Lancashire, 13-7, takes on Frank Dont from Antwerp, Belgium, at 14-2, just inside the light heavyweight level. Eight five-minute rounds, two falls to decide. Seconds away, round one. And it's Paul Mitchell, the Englishman this time, in the leotard. Referee Emil Poilve, Anglo-Italian, brought in for this uh, tournament here this afternoon to square it up a bit on the third man in the ring. One, two, three. Frank Dant from Belgium can't be too used to the British freestyle rules, though he has, of course, fought many Britons over there, although it's his first visit to England. <laughs> yes, it was neat. <laughs> and Paul Mitchell grins a little bit uh, surprised by the ease that the opponent cut out of there. Oh, thinking of submissions or a nice back roll. Beautiful back roll into an arm lock by Daunt. Remember in the situation, Great Britain versus the other members of the ECC. EEC, I should say. Uh, the, French, the Frenchman Ricard has put them one up against Britain at the moment. With his win over John Naylor by a knockout, Naylor failing to beat the count. So it's up to Paul Mitchell to square things a bit. But he's gonna have a job on this. Frank Dant is a powerful looking boy. And a cross press to Dant. Belgian hesitated a bit long then. Mitchell allowed Mitchell to walk in on a leg grab in his own time, more or less. Step over toe hold, Mitchell. Left the toe, put the bar through. There's the figure four leg lock with bar. Neatly out by Dante there. Tough hole to get out of that uh, figure four leg. And he's got that folded leg pretty firmly. He's 
time Mitchell tries for a counter hold, Dont lays it on a little harder. Less than a minute. Toe and ankle and the turn didn't come, the spin out didn't arrive. Mitchell meant it, but didn't time it right. There's the toe and ankle again. Mitchell tried it again, but don't let it go very gently through his arms. And is still holding it. Half a minute. Far-reaching referees hold, they came together with then. Both of them are trying to grab it, and it's Dont who wins it. But he's only got about five seconds to go. This boy, Frank Dont from Antwerp, 14 stone 2, his first time in England. He's been a full-time professional wrestler since 1969 only. And this is his first television appearance ever, because in Belgium they seldom have uh, televised wrestling. In France, of course, they do, and in Spain, Germany, but not in Belgium so often. Seconds away, round two. Round two, seven rounds to go, and no score in this eight-round contest. Two falls to decide. Paul Mitchell for Great Britain versus Frank Dont for Belgium. And a figure four leg lock to Mitchell. But he's a great counter mover, this Belgian. And not a bad attacker either into a figure four leg lock again. And Mitchell's going to have trouble here. Feet down first. Drop kick to the arm. And a lovely crutch hold and slam to Dont and the reverse double knee hold too far off, but he's still gonna get it. He's got it. And the good lucky boy from Belgium there gets the first fall over Paul Mitchell, Martin Conroy. Ladies and gentlemen, after one minute and 22 seconds of round two, the first fall goes to Frank Dunk. And very neatly done, and Paul Mitchell coming over to congratulate him on that first fall, but there's still six rounds to go. Let's see what happens, because in a few seconds they'll have to come out for round three. Seconds away. Round three. Remember, Mitchell for Britain in the leotard. Trailing by that one fall Dunt just scored in the second. And again, the double interlock with Dunt in charge. Boy Dont is really gonna give some trouble to Mitchell here this afternoon. Look at that counter. Full Nelson Mitchell turned nicely to a head mayor. Followed on a bit slow, but he got a second chance at it, and Dont managed to complete the somersault before he got there. Bit risky.